everyone, this is Ryan from the Unobtainables. Today we are going to be taking a look at set 9445, Fangpire Truck Ambush. This set was released in 2012. It has 436 pieces and has four minifigs. On the internet used, you can get it for about $35. And if you want it new on the internet, you can get it for about $150. This set comes with two manuals. They have the same design, except for this, these two here. And on them, they have um, that ice spike. And then back here, you have these guys fighting. And then the fang hire truck. Now let's take a look at the minifigures. This first minifigure, Fangdom, um, looks really cool. He has this really unique headpiece with some printing on the back, um, some printing on the torso and on his head here. And he has two heads and he has some more printing here and some white arms and some red pants with more printing there. And he also comes with this little shuriken here. The next minifigure up is Fang Tom. And he is very unique. And he's literally $20 just by himself. And um, he's really unique too. He's like the other guy, but he has this um, snake body. And then he has some printing here on the back. And that same snake head. He also comes with this snake staff here where he can hold it there. And then he has some more printing here on the front, including on this nice piece at the bottom. The next minifigure is Zane. And he has a shuriken and a sword. And he has this. Um, armor here and then he also has some designs there then he has this cool ninja helmet and some printing here and you can even take his sword and you can come back here and you can put it into there for storage and then the last minifigure you have Jay and he has some that same armor piece where you can put the sword there if you want he has some printing here on the back he has the same ninja helmet but in a different color then he has some nice printing here on his torso and pants and then he has just this head and i guess that's it for the minifigures The builds for this set are actually pretty cool, and let's start out by taking a look at the ice bike. So, the front of it, it has these two stickers here. One here that has some nice details of like ice shards, and then one here with more ice shards. And you can angle it up or down if you want. And then moving backward on the build, we have this cool ice piece here. And then we have some gold details here and here. And we also have this area back here with more ice. And then the spike actually only has one wheel back here, making use of these pieces. And another one of those ice pieces. And then over here, as you can see, there's a little area here for Zane to go and stand to drive the bike. And then going to the main build, we have the Fangpire truck. And it's a pretty beefy build, if I do say so myself. It's really cool. And it has this tail back here that you can move all the way around. And I, I like 
how it can do that. And then in the front, you can see how it has like a mouth here. And it can open up to have a bigger mouth, a smaller mouth. But if you want it all the way closed, you kind of have to move the teeth out of the way. And then it has some nice designs here for the eyes. And then it has some really nice stickers here that I think are pretty cool. And then it has this area here and it has a little steering wheel here and just a cockpit and you can fit a minifigure in there then you have some like engine sort of looking stickers and then that's the same on both sides and there's a tnt on this side in these cabinets and then on this side there's nothing unfortunately and then these pieces are pretty unique and they have this sticker here same on the other side and there, then there's also these tubes here both sides and then back here there's this like purple flame piece as for the exhaust it has two of those and then has these um a lot of support for the wheels and you can press it down a lot if you want for good suspension and then this tail as you can see actually is made of multiple different compartments not compartments little sections and then this tail over here you can adjust this part to be how you want both of these if you want it like that you can have it like that and then you just move it even like that and you can adjust these if you want them in a different position. And that's pretty much it for this set. I hope you enjoyed. That was Ryan from the Unattainables. Don't forget to like and subscribe. See you all next time. Bye.